こんにちは皆さん、はじめまして、マックスです。お願いします。ボンジョーコモタリブジョーマックス。マックス。夜のハセオマックスミダ。Hi, everybody. Welcome back to another brand new live video for all the girls, for the children, and for the stripper princess. Glow in the dark fantasy today with none other than Lizzy Liz is in the house. Hourglass Beauty Bar, make sure you like and follow. Smash the like button for Hourglass. What, what? And for all. Is Fro watching? Yeah, Fro is not watching, but he might bring us hot dogs. R and R. Mm -hmm. I brought a salad today, but I even haven't even eaten it. So, so you need a Mexican hot dog in your life. Uh, I'm They're not really so hungry. Good, Mike. You, oh gosh, I haven't had a Mexican hot dog in a long time. I'm a bad influence on you. But I, does it have beans in it? I don't know. He was like, oh, because he's going to go finish a job on 22nd. So I was like, oh, you'll be right by me. You can bring me a Mexican hot dog. And he's like, if they're there. Hot dogs. And, yeah. And I was like. Because Lizzie Liz will eat two. I only like 10. But I'll, really? I only have time during our thing. During you do. <laughs> well, yeah. He said if he could find them. So I said, you find me Mexican hot dogs. They're sir. all over the place. Exactly. Like we live in Tucson. Find those hot That's dogs. It's not a hard thing. How is everybody doing today? I hope you guys had an incredible and blessed weekend. Lizzie Liz is here and we're going to be using Coquette Charms on her. I'm so excited. And we're going to be doing an encapsulated design, also known as a lazy girl design. We're going to be using pig glitter and tiger glitter from the Zodiac collection. We're going to be using donut white, which is a ombre white acrylic that glows in the dark. And we're going to be using butter pink, which is also another glow in the dark acrylic. And we're going to be using cool pink bubble gum gel to apply them. And we're going to be using pink Coquette diamonds and then silver and white diamonds for Lizzie Liz. So, so that we got a lot to do today so on Lizzie excited. Liz. So excited. Yes, we do. And all during that, we need to see how many hot dogs we can eat. In a short amount of time. Without people hearing us cheer. And she brought me a Jamba Juice. Oh, I'm so nice. This is my first Jamba Juice and I get to share it with you guys live on television. I'm doing good. A little tired. As you guys know, Peaches had four puppies. One passed away. But Aww. three are alive and they're all girls. Three little girls. So this weekend we've been uh, bottle feeding them and keeping them warm. And yesterday it arrived. It's like a like a teddy bear, like a dog shaped teddy bear, and it has a little heart that you put inside of it, and it goes. Dun, 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 oh, so it makes me feel comforted. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's so cute. I feel like I need one of those. So, froze comforted. <laughs> so it goes. Dun, 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 dun. And then today the uh, the teat is supposed to arrive, so that way they can bottle feed by themselves oh, on the teat cool. instead of us having to bottle feed them. Because it scares me to bottle feed them too, because you yeah. don't want to overfeed them too or force them. So. Hopefully that arrives too, and they survive. Three little girls are so cute. Aww. Two hairless and one with hair. And what else is going on? Oh, our sale is free shipping worldwide, no promo code needed. So if you order wow. one thing, or if you order a hundred things right now, everybody gets free shipping for the next five days. And there's something else going on. It's my birthday. Is it really? No. Oh, it just passed. I just, if you, anybody wants to cash at me. <laughs> my birthday's coming up. It is, it is. Mm -hmm. Disneyland. Yes. I have not. I haven't named them because uh, we might give two away. Um, as you guys know, my parents are older. Don't tell my mom that. But uh, right now we have three dogs. We want to give one away tomorrow. And then we might only keep one of the female dogs. Female dogs are, are easier to handle than male dogs, I think. I think they're like very loyal. They're awesome. My baby girl is the best. But I love the gentleman. And he's a, he's a really exceptionally good dog. There was something else I wanted to, to point out and I forgot. Oh, I remember now. So color scoops are back on the website. We put a hundred color scoops back on the website because I know you guys love color scoops. There is no regular one, two, three, go scoops or anything else, but color scoops, we do have some on the website. So if you guys want to get color scoops, now's a great time to sack up before Mother's Day. So you can get a color scoop and you can get it for free shipping. And wow. most orders right now ship within one to two days because the girls here don't play. So make sure you order so that way you can get your little scoop, get you some, some glow in the dark acrylic, get you some bubble gum gel. Taffy will be back in stock really soon. So yeah, a lot of stuff going on. And this is like, Max, can I come in earlier? But I was like so overwhelmed with work and I wanted to make sure I was done with everything I needed to take care of before I started snatching Lizzie's Philanzies. Yes. So. so I cleaned my salon. Oh, my and mom's calling. Hold on, hold on. Shoes. Let's see what she's saying. Hello? This is time. Acabo de empezar. Estás en el de este. Ya llegó la, la de esta para las perras. No, ¿y cómo están? Ah, uh, ¿y ahorita cómo está? 
Ay, pobrecita, pero sí estaba morada cuando la vi yo en la mañana también. Ay, bueno, ok, bye. Oh, she called me to tell me that she had to give um, CPR to one of the puppies. Oh, no. This morning I told her too, I was like, the puppy looks kind of purplish. So I don't know, it was because she's a hairless one, so I was like, maybe she's gonna be a dark hairless one because they have different colors. And uh, she told me that she wasn't, uh, she was a little purple, so she had to give her a little bit of CPR. Aww. So hopefully that she makes it. Poor so baby. I'm so st Cindy Chris said hello, hello. Hi, happened? Cindy, the puppies. You want to see? I showed you a picture, right? Mm -hmm. I'll show so you guys cute. really cute. They're very cute. He asked oh. me if I want one, but I have a big pity girl. And As you I guys can see, one of them, them. It's kind of she. She looks kind of purplish. Yeah, that I noticed that when I looked at the mm -hmm. photo. Aww. So my mom says that she wasn't breathing well. So hopefully she's okay. If not, we want to keep this white one though, because we already have peaches. Mm -hmm. And this white one looks kind of like my dog that passed away. It looks like Milen. So it's like Milen reincarnated. So oh, yes. hopefully they make it okay. But I am excited for this full set, you guys, because you guys know I love a good princess nail. I'm trying to look for my apron. Have you seen it, what I did with it? I have not, Maxine. What are you going to do with my apron? What did you do with my apron, Gloria? Sorry, I was not here yesterday from Madeline. Jewels, not tools, nails said, what breed are they? They are Chinese Crescent and, um, Chinese Crescent and like one eighth Chihuahua. That's why they're so small. Mm -hmm. We weren't here yesterday either. We Sundays are the days of the Lord. Mackenzie Lane 918 said, Will you bring the story nail foil back? Mm -mm. Only some foils are coming back in stock, which are the ones that are on the website right now. All other foils have been discontinued. But I did mention that color scoops are back on the website and you can get those now. And most of them ship same day or next day. So if you want to order and have your order for Mother's Day, um, order now. Jamba Juice, yes, Lizzie got me my first I Jamba got him Juice his ever. First Jamba juice. He got like the vitamin C boost. It had all the vitamins in there. Yeah, because I'm trying. No more Starbucks uh, spicy. Have you ever had one before? They're so good. But they like, have a lot of sugar. The spicy lemonades? No, they're like, like a refresher with tahini. So good. Yeah, but it has sugar. All those things have sugar. And lots of salt and sodium. And like this yes. morning, I got new jeans. They're 28 by 32. They're Levi's they're actually. Tiny. And I had to like. You should have seen me trying to put them on, it was not. You should have filmed it yourself trying to it put them on. It was not cute, it was not my best moment. Jewels by, Jewels Not Tools Nails said what, Brita, oh no, she said, aw, so cute. Where is my apron? I had family issues on Friday, that's from Madeline. Well, sorry to hear that. Max, you better put something on. I'm gonna ask Gloria to look for Get it right going. Mm. I'm so bossy. Aren't all women bossy? Yes. Yesterday, I was on one because I was super hungry. I was being mean to everybody. Which hand do you want to do first, my love? Which one do you want me to Up do to first? you. Up to you. You want to do this one? Sure. So, I started watching Shows of Sunset. Have you ever seen that show? I've only seen like a little part of it while I was getting my lashes on, but you have to keep your eyes closed, so no, not really. Oh, you would like it because <laughs> this one lady that the mom is kind of like, she's wild. Her name is Vida. Vida. Okay. And the daughter's name is Mercedes, and she tells her Vida she's Vida like, Mercedes. Yes, Vida's like... Mercedes, that dress makes you look fat. I don't like this dress. Are they beautiful, the girls? Um, Mercedes uh, is very curvy, like real I'm curvy. curvy. That's why I ordered me a BBL mannequin. <laughs> and with a head? No head, oh. no head. We don't need a head. Um, men don't care. Men don't care about your head. Um, it is, has not arrived yet, so I'll let you know. I'll bring her next time. Are you excited? Day. I'll bring her and she can stand right behind you and be so alive. She can be my backup. How many did you get? One or two? Just one. You should one have gotten two. With. Oh my gosh. So I've been listening to this like murder podcast and there were these two twin blonde girls that were yoga teachers. The Barbie twins. They were called like the, like, I don't know. Yes, you've heard of them? They no. were, well, they were based in Miami, but one of them like killed the other one. It was a mm. wild story. Yeah. A long time ago or when? Yeah, I think it was a long time ago. We're going to use the duet bit to begin to prep the nail, but there really were some girls that called themselves the Barbie twins. Yeah, I've heard of them, but I, well, I was like, wait, they got yoga. In Miami. In Miami. But, um... Yeah, I was like, aren't yoga teachers supposed to be peaceful or hippies, not murdering crazy psychos? Because they also got like a bunch of DUIs and they would like fight all the time, like fist fight. And wow. I'm like, that doesn't sound very yoga-ish, ladies. I mean, trust me, I don't always have yoga-ish behavior myself. But <laughs> I have not killed anyone. Yes. <laughs> yes. 
I'm trying to remember what else I did yesterday. Oh, so we were like taking care of the puppies and then um, I put on an old Mexican movie for my dad so that we could all watch it together. Oh, that's so cute. What movie? It was called Lola La Trailera, the biggest grossing Mexican movie of all time. I'm gonna... It's I'm gonna about a girl it. truck driver. Oh my god, I love it already. She And she fights crime in Is her... Is she sexy? Yes. Yeah, but funny. she's actually like a good, like a very classy kind of sexy. Like she never drank she's got, like, or anything. stickers on her water bottle. Just kidding. <laughs> No, a little bit more torn down. More more <laughs> PG-13. But those movies are so bad, they're good. And every movie she made, because she made a lot of movies, her husband was always her um, co-star. Oh, that's so cute. He was he was probably really jealous cause, because she was really famous because of her legs. She had oh. really big legs. Oh, I love big legs. Mm -hmm. I want to watch it now. I wonder what, like, how do you Lola, watch Lola the it? Truck Driver on YouTube for free. What? Oh, yeah. What can't Pro you find will on be into it. He'll remember the good remember. old days. And, he'll be like, I watched this with the VR. and then there was a truck, a, like a semi, with all the um, the hoochie mamas on there. Oh my god, I love that. And the madam of the of the hoochie mama truck, her name was Amapola, which means poppy. Poppy. So I we like can that do name. The, poppy. Yeah. We can do like an American version of it. Oh my god, yes. And Claudia she has, can be the truck driver. Claudia can be the Jeff truck driver. And then the song goes, Ahí viene Lola, Lola la trailera, oh exactly. buscando yeah. justicia en toda la frontera. Ahí Is viene it Lola. In English? I'm no, sure it's in Spanish, that yeah. Like the movie was all over the world, too. We're gonna go in now with our skinny Sandy Ben and Mandrill. Uh, Froll says he likes my nails better like this, how they look right now. Yeah. I think he's a liar because I can, he thinks maybe I can just do more stuff with them. I'm like surprised this. he hasn't said, I like your nails French shit. No, yeah. He's apparently lying. I mean, hello, viewers. You can see my nails. I think he and needs to get his eyes checked. After. I think he just thinks I can do more kind of work and cleaning business without them on. Well, but it's that's nice. That's exactly why I don't want them on. You're like, I need, I need my long, glamorous phalanges. So that I can be like, I can't clean the toilet. You're like, you clean them you, <laughs> yourself. Outhouse for you, sir. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, I think he's a liar. And a bad one. Mm. I like your nose like that. Why? How sad. <laughs> I like you better without makeup. Yeah, that's another lie. Just kidding. I think he doesn't notice if I'm wearing makeup or not. That's or weird. when men say, I like what you look like when you first wake up in the morning. And ugh. You're like, really? <laughs> no, even, okay, Claudia, my daughter, she is like the most beautiful woman alive. I love her to death. Miss well, Universe she 2024. Up when she wakes up or like when she sleeps, because sometimes she sleeps their mouth open, she's going to kill me if she joins us. But like, even her, who I just find to be the most beautiful creature on the planet, I'm like, looks kind of funny when she wakes You're like, it's not your best. <laughs> not your best moment, child. I look funny when I wake up, too. I look I look all swollen and puffy and, like, I my face is... anybody's best. And they always say a woman looks more beautiful when she first wakes up in the morning. Mm, I, I mean, my stomach looks awesome because I haven't eaten for, like, eight hours. I need a poop better. as soon as I wake up. I poop in the morning too. Jules not tools nail said they look they like me as a train wreck. Question mark explanation. I know exactly. They're just lying because they don't want other men to, you know, be all after you. So they encourage us those like train wrecks. R N N R seventy said hello Matt. Who's that? R N N R seventy. Oh know. I thought it was Ruben. Oh no. Cause he, R and R he doesn't really have Instagram. I run that. Oh. Yeah. Hello, thanks for joining us today, my love. Hey, Max and everyone. Nails by Maddie. Are you guys excited for the coquette design today? You guys I know. I am. Do I count? Yes. <laughs> well, you're the muse anyway. I'm very excited. And then I told Dizzy Liz she needs to be here for my moral support because we're gonna. I'm getting um, interviewed. So you guys remember I had mentioned that uh, somebody had reached out to me to record a video for her podcast. She's coming Thursday. Oh, wait, so you're, you're like, your face won't be on it or it will? It or will. Like, okay, it's so, not just a voice box. I'll now. show you what her videos look like okay. later. Do you want me to bring my BBL mannequin and stand behind you? Yes. You, comfort? you can <laughs> nestle your head in between her boobs. <laughs> she, I can have her sit on my lap. Yeah. I'll be like, I feel like I'm at the strip club. <laughs> Minus you're the like, money. This is my wife. And her that name. That video will go sideways. Her so name fast. is. <laughs> She doesn't talk, but she's headless. Sin cabeza. Sin cabeza. <laughs> her name is Lola La Trailera. We're going to go in with a little bit of primer. I'm like, they're going to think you're like a serial killer if you do that. Don't do that. And I, I uh, <laughs> have fava beans with her. Oh my goodness. Like Hannibal Lecter. 
Nails by Maddie says, will you be sharing it with us? Yeah, but it's not on my channel. It's on hers. It's going to be, I think, on her YouTube channel. But um, I've seen a few videos of them, of hers. And they're all in Spanish. So I believe that this interview will be in Espanol. Oh, gosh. This is going to get more complicated because... Um, so our plan was, I'm going to say, please don't speak to Max. Direct all your questions at me. And then Max will whisper in my ear. And then I'll have to say it. But my Spanish isn't that great. So this is also going to get very So you're going to get ugly. like, hola, por favor. It'll take a really long time to translate. Pregunta in English <laughs> only. Senorita Bonita. I, oh yeah. What's her channel name? That's from Alejandra, Alejandra PTN. That's a great question. And honestly, I don't know. I think her name was Patricia. Her name is Patricia. I think. Figure it out, guys. Just kidding. We'll find out. Know. We'll find out on Thursday when she pops up. I think she's coming. I think she lives in California or oh, that's really somewhere cool. else. So she's coming just to film the, the interview. Oh, that's very cool. Where is she staying? At your house? No. I don't know Maybe who she brother? is. Just You're not going to let her stay at your house, man? No. I live in a very small, modest home. So if you lived in a mansion, you'd let her stay? Probably not. I'd be like, sorry. I think you'd be less like. I don't have any room. So are you gonna like hang out with her outside of the interview? That's what are I was you thinking. I was like, best friend, you have to take her to eat. I'll go to that. <laughs> I was thinking. I was like, what? What happened? Okay, here's the interview. No, I have to film after, because I have a model on Thursday. Oh yeah, so you can't entertain her. No, I'm like, you okay. You take her to the strip club at night. <laughs> with Claudia. Mm-hmm. You were uh, supposed to go last time with Claudia and you I know, ditched her, I didn't. Child. She hates me for Max it. Max didn't have anything to wear. She's going to beat me up. And we're like, Max, guess what? Nobody's wearing anything. It's fine. <laughs> they're wearing earrings. They're wearing shoes. They're wearing eyelashes. So you could wear shoes and eyelashes. And perfume. <laughs> Victoria's Secret body spray. The body spray, bath and body. Cindy Chris said no. No what? So does anybody know what nails Lizzie Liz gets? Let's see who pays attention. Do you guys even know me at all? Do you guys remember her signature? I think Cindy Chris is saying, no, you cannot go to a strip club, Max. Absolutely not. No gracias. Not, nope. not this time, Jesus. Not allowed. No Diddy moments. No P Diddy moments. Oh, no taking her out, Cindy Chris. Mm -mm, you're not allowed to take her out either. She's not my friend. She might be your friend. She might replace me. Nobody can replace you. Oh, I well, thank you. You're one of a kind. One of a kind, Lizzie Liz. Where is my racer clear? I need to encapsulate. Gosh, how many easy, easy ombre powders do I need? Ruption sculpture pipe. Court Cunningham. She knows me. She knows me. You can put this one to the side because we're going to encapsulate like, the design. out of my face, that ugly boy man hand. <laughs> we have to snatch it up first. So we're going to go in with some... What did Gloria do here? Did she tidy up for you? No, she moved things around and now why? like... Why? She if she's not tidying up, why would she move anything? Because she likes to make my life miserable. She just likes to mess with you? She does. So if I'm ever really mad at you, I'm just going to come here and move, move everything things. around. Let's use her Sailor Magic acrylic brush. How could I ever be mad at Max? A lot of people hate me. They don't even know me. Why? Tell me why. Because they're oh, miserable. The <laughs> what did you do? So we're gonna do some pink and some white. So the pink ones will not have roses on there. No roses. For no pink. roses on the pink. I'm really excited. I haven't had nails for like a little while. Oh, the old like guy, a week. the Jim. I think his name's Jeff. I don't know. But Jeffrey Dahmer. He's really excited because he's like, he always says he can't recognize me if I don't have my nails on, and I'm like, sir, you are not looking at my nails. Oh, but he really appreciated my toenails because I was walking around with no shoes on because I was at yoga. Uh -huh. So then he was really entranced with my hot pink toenails. Esmeralda did your toes, didn't mm -hmm. she? Yep. So that's tiger glitter. And then we're going to take another little bead of racer clear. Encapsulate that so that way when we put the, um, the donut white acrylic on top of it, it will not bleed into it. So I promise the old guys my nails will be back tomorrow. They're all looking forward to it, Max. You have a whole gym full of old men that can't wait to oh see you. Oh my your gosh, work. the pressure is on. <laughs> what about, do you have any events coming up? Yes, I have the Bridal Expo, mm -hmm. May 19th. And then after that, there will be a women's networking event at my salon June 8th. <gasps> I won't be here, or actually I might. What is it? Mm -hmm. There's going to be food and there's just, so this time it's not just going to be beauty women. It's going to be like real estate agents, finance people, you know, all just the different, different women's event. Jobs. Yeah. Like all kinds of different networking. 
So that should be super fun. And there will That's be food. Tiger. What kind of fan. food? I don't know yet. I was thinking, I don't say this word correctly, but a charcuterie board. Did I say it right? Charcuterie? Charcuterie, yes. Um, I was thinking of doing that because I saw this really cool picture. And I'm going to try to recreate it and go to like Sprouts or Trader Joe's and recreate it myself. Why don't you get it sponsored? By who? Uh, some woman's uh, um, thingamajiggy. Okay. A woman uh, caterer or something. Oh, like if she would donate it for the free? Uh-huh. Okay. Because it's for her business. That. Yeah, that's true. And, and she can promote it. And be true. like, the snacks are provided by so-and-so catering. Mm-hmm. And I'll say it right. Car char what? Charcuterie? Charcuterie. Charcuterie board. If you make it, I will say it right, I promise. Just make sure it's delicious. Yes, delicious. Like, it needs that really good cheese, really good meat. I also like nuts and olives. Like, oh, I got some olives yesterday from Sprouts. So good. Were they so good? See, they I were garlic really stuffed good. olives. Not good for, like, my water retention, but... I can't say no to a good olive. They're so good. Lisa Faye said good idea. He always has good ideas. Erica Starling 34 said charcuterie. Charcuterie. Gonna... Yeah, that's right. I'm going to remind it because you just said cooter and I'm not going to forget the cooter. So, like, so now you remember. Charcuterie. A cooter board. A cooter board. I want one of them cooter boards. <laughs> <laughs> that's so what I'm going to remember now. And then like have jars of pickles too. You're like, have a pickle with your cooter. Eat a pickle. Tickle your pickle. <laughs> and then you're going to have, uh, what are you going to call your, your mannequin? I feel like you should call her Monica. That's a good stripper name. But I have a girl named Monica that works there, and that's oh. confusing. Because she's they're like, is that who's doing my lashes? <laughs> <laughs> yes, without any face. No, I should name her Poppy or Lola. Oh, Poppy. Poppy and Lola. <laughs> I like it. We were learning how to use our cricket yesterday, Sarah and I, and the, it was a thing. I forgot what it's actually called. But we thought it was, oh, it's called a weeder. It's like a tool, but we thought the lady said beavers. So whatever it's like, we're like, now we just call it the beaver. Uh, we, let me ask Ramfix if he has any um, women-owned J-Dub businesses. Is there any J-Dub uh, female businesses, Roundface? Uh, yeah, so that way they can go. food? Yes. You don't gotta say J-Dub between it's just female. But we want J-Dub ones. So that I way don't they care who they are if they have food. Right? So that way they can come and tell us about the studio. Um, I actually know some people that make sugar. Shut Ooh, up! Excuse me. Are they women? They are. Would they like to come to the event and bring one? Bring a cooter board. To the event? Sharing is caring. <laughs> They're gonna be like that girl Lizzie with the Liz. long nails ate all the cooter board. <laughs> There's no one at the event. It's just Lizzie. With I you. know. It's just me in the back eating all the meat. with the mannequin. Yeah, me and Lola, we're gonna eat the cooter board. And then I'll be like, you're gonna be like, Max, are you coming? I'm like, I don't have anything to wear. Oh gosh. I'll be like, wear something of my mannequin. <laughs> Is Claudia gonna be there? No, probably not. Ooh. Cooter board, Lisa Faye. That's what it's gonna be known as forever. Now I don't have to worry about sounding fancy because I'm just gonna call it cooter board. <laughs> the cooter board. <laughs> Ooh, I think we're getting Mexican hot dogs, everybody. Why well, is he coming? That's what he said. Mm. But I can't answer him because I'm busy right now. So I'm modeling. he brings like eight of them. I'm a model right now. I cannot eat your Mexican hot dog. Just kidding. In the break, we can. In the intermission. In the intermission, I can sell like four hot dogs in my mouth. I actually wanted to go see Hairspray, but I didn't go. Is it Was it a, like a play? Yes, like a it musical? was last weekend. Not this weekend, but the last weekend. Oh, why didn't you go? Because I'm still jet lagged. Oh, yeah. I get you. We're old now, Max. We're old. We're 25. And I, it takes longer for me to recover. Mm -hmm. Plus, it was such an exhausting trip. Yeah, it looked really fun, though. It looked so fun. Like, I forget that, like, literally on Wednesday, I had done, like, a mini facelift. So, I was like, I need to let my body heal. Yeah, you didn't recover at all. See, that's why I bought you the vitamin C boost. Now you're going to be great. To put me up. Thank you up. Erica Starling said, I guess I started something. You should start a business called Cooter Boards. Mm -hmm. And you sell them. Cooter Boards oh. International. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Nails by Fur said, what are Mexican hot dogs? Okay, you need to go on a plane to Tucson right now. They're like Sonoran hot dogs. They're it's a very regional food. So mm -hmm. good. It's like this bun that's really, like, delightful. And then there's a hot dog wrapped in bacon. And then you put all kinds of stuff on it, like beans, like pinto beans, tomatoes, onion, mustard. No, it's like Mexican beans, isn't it? Mexican beans. Isn't that what pinto beans are? No. What kind of beans are they, round face? Peanut, peanut, peanut. Oh my god. Are they? Are you sure? Yeah. 
They're not refried. And then the, the sausage, the frank, is wrapped in uh, bacon. Bacon? Oh but my god, it's grilled. so good. Everything is grilled, and then it has like mayonnaise, mustard, tomatoes, onions. A little I bit of hot sauce. You can put cheese on them. I don't know, but they're like You can put delightful. mushrooms on them, oh, avocado. Yeah. yeah, they're like the best. Salsa. The best. Yeah, salsa, all kinds of stuff. You need, you really need a Mexican hot dog. And I, and I guess they really don't have them that many other places, huh? Mm -mm. Plus Claudia's dad tried to buy a car and start it in San Diego and it didn't really take off. In California they have, they call them um, Tijuana style hot dogs. It's but like a Tijuana style. They're a copy of the Sonoran hot dog, oh, but it's not no, as good. They copied me. It's, it's like not as good. City or East Bay has like their own version. Their own version no, of it. No, 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 no. And yeah. some people think hot dogs are gross, but I'm like, yum, I love hot dogs. I like for breakfast, I like the um, Oscar what? Mayer, the... Uh, Huevos con weenies? Yes, but the Oscar Mayer one has one that has cheese inside of oh, it. It's so good. Oh, yeah, I've had that. I made the bombest breakfast today, and then Fro left it in the truck. Brown face makes fun of me because I like it. It's very childish, but I get it. You're going to help me right now, too. You're going to hold Ooh. the magic wand, and you're going to press it. The little button when I tell you to, okay? Okay, good luck with me, Max. You gonna go party now? Gonna check up on Shalissa? They told. They told me that she might not. Ha she might need a new um. Roommate. You gonna go shopping for those uh, Star Wars Crocs? You There's like actual Star Wars Crocs. There's she. No, you need the the new one with the Baby Yoda. Yeah, I know. I'll ask like the other. You have Crocs, Max. I don't. I stopped wearing them when I lost weight because uh, uh, I associate Crocs with me being more morbidly obese. Oh, why is it because they were comfortable? Yeah, and I would wear Crocs with Adidas sweatpants. So for the longest time, I didn't wear sweatpants. Oh, no, I do. Crocs. No, huh? you look awesome. They're not that comfortable. They're no? not that comfortable, but they're very convenient. Yeah. Because there's times when I'm standing, I'm like, they're all right. And then another thing that I used to do that was very unhealthy, but I still do, which I shouldn't, is eat and watch television at the same time. I do that all the time because we always eat in our bedroom. Okay, bye, guys. Bye. bye. Because, like, Fro wants to eat in the bedroom, but then he gets mad because I eat on the bed. But I'm like, well, we don't have a kitchen table in here, so what am I supposed to eat? You need a little, like, tree, uh, TV tray. A little TV tray. I know. I know. Like on Timu or something. I know. But I'm like, I would be fine eating at the kitchen table or the little counter. But. You're he... excited to use that wand, huh? Yeah. I'm like, tell me when it's my time, Max. I've just been pushing it a couple times, getting myself all ready. Getting practicing. I can come and do this for you, you know. Like You're going to be, <laughs> for the, um. <laughs> for the interview? Yes. That's my job. I'm going to push the light. Do you guys think it's appropriate that I ask for the, the list of the questions too? Yes, I do. Okay. Let's... Every time I hear the doorbell, I'm like, it's our hot dogs. Um. You get excited. I get so excited. I'm excited for the hot dog. I'm excited to push the button and make the light come on in the wand. I'm just all excited. Okay, press. Oh my god, I'm doing it, Maxie. Closer? There you go. Okay, turn it off. I have a new talent in life, guys. Look, look at, at that, that, you guys. She is the real deal. I, you know what I look like so far with my one nail Press. on? Um, the Good Witch in The Wizard of Oz. Yes, and Glenda. Glenda. You're the Ariana Grande version of Glenda. <laughs> she wishes. Ariana Grande turn is off. too skinny for me to be her. Skinny and uh, a little bit awkward looking too. Cindy she looks. Chris she makes said, a horrible blonde. Look how pretty these oh, are. Cindy Chris said yes, so you can better prepare yourself. Yes, but that's why the lady wants an organic interview, so she might not want Max to be prepared. She maybe she's gonna catch you off center Trippin'. and be like, "Is it true that you killed four people and threw them in a ditch?" <laughs> like maybe she and ate their head. Throw you off, yeah. She's gonna come at you with some like crazy tea. That's not true. And they're like, okay. Um, Is it true that you have an alien baby? <laughs> <laughs> Those dogs are really your children. Um, Erica Starling34 said, did you Press, do a base? I did not. Because I want to show you guys that you can still get incredible retention with bubblegum gel directly to the natural nail. And then Cindy Chris said, you need topics. That's what I thought too. I was like, what are we gonna talk about during the interview? But if it's awkward, then it's going to be her fault. 
I don't think it'll be awkward though. Well, it won't be like super I mean, I hope not. But it just depends if she's like how engaging she is. Yes, in if she's her. engaging as well. Cindy Crystal, organic doesn't mean you go in unprepared. True that. True that. Okay, freeze this one for me. Mm -hmm. Gonna pinch it a little bit so that way it's more skinny mini. <laughs> Okay, let's do this one. Pinch it a little bit. Well, oh, they feel really hard, huh? Mm-hmm. I have found a new talent. You guys, teamwork makes the, the dream, dream work. work. We're a power couple over here. Look how pretty they look. I'm Glenda the Good Witch. Homera 65 said pre-designed home. Oh, these are pre-designed nails, question mark. No, we designed them ourselves here on the live. If you missed any part of it, you can also re-watch this video, my lovely. So now we're gonna clean out the inside with a little orange wood stick, scrape out any excess. Where did Ralph face go? I'm gonna have him look for my apron. Oh yeah. Look at that, it just comes off so beautifully. Do you sell the aprons? Yes. They're very cute. I want to cook dinner in it with nothing else on. Just that. Mm -hmm. Do you wear an apron when you uh, do your services? I don't mm -mm. remember, huh? Mm -mm. No, you should. Do you want me to give you one? Yeah. Would you wear it when yes. I, at, at Hourglass? Yes, because sometimes I get gel all over me, which it doesn't stain or anything, but it's just a little gooey. Or gooey as you know, because you got a little gooey problem. <laughs> all over me. A little goo on you. So now we're gonna put a little bit of shiny on the inside to seal everything, keep them nice and fresh. Beautiful. And then I can put it on my um, Lola too. Yeah. No, well you have to uh, dress her up with um. Hourglass stuff. Yes. But just sometimes I'll just so she could have some fun. I'll put the apron on her. Just so she can be another woman. <laughs> yeah. Mix it up. Public cart lady said, "Brilliant. I am Sarah's mom." What Sarah? Who Sarah? There's quite a few Sarahs in my life. Wow, Max is a player, player. From the Himalayas. Am I your only Lizzie Liz? The one and only. Okay, okay. And then we got Claudia, Claudia Petrovsky. <laughs> and like Chef Karen. Chef Karen with the cheese tacos. Homera65 says, how do you feel bubblegum gel on your nails? How do you feel or how do you feel? Fe well, she won't feel, but I don't know if she meant feel. Oh, she, I think she means, how does it, like, that my question would be for you. How oh. does it feel on your nail? Oh, it feels great. It feels like everything I've always wanted. Mm -hmm. and it feels then like some. I'm Glenda the Good Witch. They are very Glenda the Good Witch, huh? <laughs> yeah. So now we're going to bake these bad boys for one minute. Oh, public cart lady says, Sarah from Inkblot Media, your friend from Canada in Milan. Oh, I know who it is. He got very excited. <gasps> yes, I love her. She had this blouse, this blouson, giant black blouse. And the back said, I have nothing to wear. And I was like, I need that. Oh my God, Go Max, that where did me. she get it? I don't know. You where did you it. get it, Sarah's mom? And she's an architect. She's an artist. She does everything. Like, you oh, guys wow. need to follow this woman. What is her Instagram? Homera said heavy or light. Oh, they feel like medium. I wouldn't say like super light or they don't feel heavy. They feel like medium, regular. Mm -hmm. They feel nice. She's so cool. When is Sarah coming to eat Mexican hot dogs with us? <laughs> Sarah's in Tokyo right now. Is she? Yeah. She's going to be there for a month. Alejandra PTN said, I'm addicted to your products. They're the best. I tell everyone that, oh, I, I, oh, the girl. So I went to go deliver this waist trainer to a girl on the south side and she told me to oh, yeah, come we're on in the her phone. house. Yeah. So I showed her, she does nails out of her house. So oh, really? I showed her your stuff and she so, said she ordered from you. What's up? Who is that? You're live on the internet. You only got two? Shout out to Lucia. Shout out to Esmeralda, Chavela, Cepillo, and the only boy. At uh, you're live, say hi. So, R and R, if you guys need any masonry, R and R, we'll hook you up. Masonry. R -R. If you pay extra, I'll come in my sexy little construction outfit and help with the Glenda Goodwitch nails. <laughs> yes. Is it done baking already? Yeah, that was fast. Let's do the inside one, just a minute. Inside, upside down. Mm -hmm. okay. I'll do it for 30 seconds. There's lasagna in the microwave. You didn't get hot dogs. Did you get me some cebolla? 
Are you gonna go to um, Bojangles this weekend for Mother's Day? <laughs> Why not? That's your spot. You can't cuss on the internet. Yeah, you're gonna get this video demonetized and taken down. Yeah, and the Max is gonna charge you millions of dollars for all the uh, loss uh, revenue. Public cart lady said Rock and Karma. Oh, that's where she got that shirt, the big shirt that said nothing oh, to wear. Oh, Rock and Karma. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna look that. Look it up. Mm hmm, mm hmm. I put on my new. Oh. Thanks for the hot dogs. Don't you live in Ontario? Cause if, oh, Sarah's mom? Yes. Because I might, a uh, cousin of mine lives out there now. She moved out there. Ooh, there so you if go. I go, then she could be my hand model. And we can do some long, glittery stripper nails on her. You said you were going to do stripper nails on me. I changed my mind. Now I'm going to the good way. Because Toronto has some of the best strip clubs in the world, actually. Toronto Bye. and Tijuana. Cities with the T. See you soon. Alright. Tell Lucia I said hi. Hey. And Cepillo. Oh my gosh. He's so mean. His poor sister. Public cart lady said yes in Chile. Oh, she's Chile. in Chile. Okay. Yeah. With the dogs? I thought it was food again. I'm sorry. I'm just really <laughs> hungry all the time. <laughs> You're like, it just happens. I know. Well, what are we talking about? Oh, I'm going to put hot dogs, chili. Okay. No, we're talking about location. Got it. She's in Chile. Her daughter's in, in Tokyo. Because they're just world travelers. All over Do the world. Do they have a PJ? A what? A PJ. What's a PJ? A private jet. Oh, I don't know. Because, I mean, they sure do travel Because I'm too old to fly commercial. Me I mean, too. uh, economy class. It's just tough. It's just tough without a PJ. Because imagine if you just have, like, a big bed. And just sleep the whole time. Yeah. Take a Zanny bar and just be like, wake me up when I get there. Yeah. You won't even, like... It wouldn't be really tough to travel, even if you're going somewhere very far away. If you go to Toronto, then email me. We can do lunch. I'm in Toronto and Chile. Okay. Economy kills. Yeah. Oh my god, especially when you're on a plane for that long. Mm hmm Yes, if I could just sleep the whole time and then eat and sleep again. I and then go up happy. and get to the go to the bathroom. Yeah. Maybe they need a treadmill on there or something, a stair climber. Just to just keep the circulation going. Person, yes. We're going to use a refine bit first to begin to blend out the cuticle area. We could do like a yoga pause. On the plane. On the PJ. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's only be us, so yeah, we can <laughs> Would it be like a Boeing 747 bit, um, plane though, that big? Or something smaller? I don't know, whatever can fit. I Yoga class, a bed, a, a double decker airplane. Yeah. What's that Snoop Dogg movie? Soul Plane. Soul Plane, like on Soul Plane. So I also got obsessed with this show. Do you have Paramount Plus, Max? I don't know. It's um, a 767. Why is that even bigger? Um. Probably. It's called 1883, and I'm like obsessed with it because I really like the girl. She's a cowgirl, and she's really pretty. I really like that show. What's it about? Well, it's like the Oregon Trail. Like, I don't know if you're too young, but if you ever played that in elementary school. Yes. Yes, so it's basically like the Oregon Trail, but it's like a show. So they have like river crossing, they fight bandits, like all kinds of stuff. But the girl's just like really cool and non-traditional for her time because she's like basically wants to be a cowboy. But she's really beautiful. So she was a cowgirl before a cowgirl was a thing? Yes. And she has lovers and all kinds of stuff. I really admire her. Lesbian like, I lovers? Her. I can't tell you or I'll have to kill you. No, oh. they're actually, no, they're not lesbian lovers. They're actually oh. men. That'd be cool if they were lesbian lovers though. Make the show more sexy. And that would have been like way out of like, you can be a cowboy and a lesbian lover in 1883. Or both. And she wore pants. I mean, she was very, like, ahead of her. That time. was very progressive yeah. for women back so in the day. I think the lesbian thing would have just been pushing the envelope. <laughs> We're going to go in with the easy bit. Blend everything out. Make sure there's no gap between the natural nail and the cuticle. Let's go in and clean, clean, Oh, you, clean. when we open it, you should show her what a Mexican hot dog is. Oh, because like, you, you got right it already. Second. Yeah, but, like... Before we sign off, you should just open the box and show her what it is. Because I feel like everyone needs to know what a Mexican hot dog is. They're technically called Sonoran style hot dogs mm -hmm. if you want to like Google it. Because they originate from the state of Sonora, which borders us. Mm -hmm. So that's, uh, it uh, crossed the border. Crossed the 
border from us. But he did not go across the border. He just went down the street from us. And it, actually, the across border. the border, they're different, too. The bread is um, bigger and more fluffy. Is it really? Yes. I used to send it um, to Claudia's dad in San Diego because I would get it at Australia Bakery and send it to him. Like, the bread? Uh-huh. They don't because have that kind of bread at the bakeries over there? That's what he said. I'm like, why don't you go to Tijuana? And he's like, they don't have it. So, I don't know, but... So, th that guy that I showed you the video dancing, that's what her dad looked like? The one that's in the video, my neck, my back, my uh-uh. I don't remember. And you're like, oh, that looks like my ex. Oh, I might have been a different one. I got a lot of exes. <laughs> the Asian dude. Yeah, I don't know. You saw a picture of her dad. Is that what he looks like? I'll show you again. Okay. Let's make sure. We have all kinds of things to show. My I know, jeez. And my bag, Mexican hot dog. <laughs> and my snacks, my Netflix. <laughs> Oh my god. We want to make sure there's no product stock. I feel like her dad looks like an Asian. What's that actor's name that's um that's in that movie that's like it's hot out here for a pimp. Oh, I know who you're talking about. Hustle I don't know. Yeah. Terrence something. Terrence Howard is that him? Terrence something. I feel like he looks like an Asian him. An Asian version of Terrence Howard. A Thai version. Is that his? Name Terrence Howard. I don't know. It's Terrence something, but brown face. You guys probably know home. Can you check for where my apron is? I lost it. My apron. Oh, can you bring it? Now that I'm almost done. How did he know that? He probably was in the bathroom when he saw it. I, I had to. Uh, I, I had to release the demon, so I probably left it in there. <laughs> You take it off when you do that? Yes, I don't want to get it dirty. As the Kraken is released. Um, Madeline Avatar said, sounds funny. Kara's creation says, yes, that's the name. Yeah, Terrence Howard. I oh my God, like it's like Kendra I watching. Not Kendra, Kara's creation. Oh, I was like, Kendra. Creation. Still, just as exciting. Kendra's going to do my hair in French braids on Friday. Are you excited? Yeah, I'm excited. And then, because then I don't have to wash my hair for like a week. And then I'm going to put in my extension extension. Because what she's putting in is just my $12 braiding hair from Amazon. Nailed by Mermaid said, hello, Max. Like, hi. Like, hey. Hi, lovely. Thanks for joining us today. I follow her on Instagram. It's just really cool posts. With those legs. The yeah, most famous legs. legs. Kira's Creation said, oh, thank you, Max. LOL. Get excited. <laughs> I just can't so hide excited. it. Madeline Avatar said hi again. Hi. Taper the nail in. Oh yeah, but so that girl, she already orders your products. Who does? The girl that I went to her house and delivered the wish And by the way, Max, she didn't kill me because here I am. What it was you? not a setup. It was not an ambush. Oh my god, oh, that's scary. When I got there, she's like, "Can you just come in?" And I'm like, "That's so weird." You're because like, "Leave like, your phone at the door." I don't even. The like lights are turned off. In my house at all. I know. So I text Claudia because Fro was busy working. So I'm like, "But I'm going inside this house to deliver the wish If don't you don't hear from out. me in 20 yeah, minutes, this is where last place I was seen. Because I'm like, it sounds. But the girl was super nice. She was just there with her little sisters and her nana. Everything was great. But me being the paranoid person that I am. Everything was Gucci. I was just like, is this a setup? Is someone trying to kill me? And then Claudia's like, mom, they could have been doing like sex trafficking, all kinds of stuff. The I was worst. just thinking like robbery, but I'm like, I don't even have any money. So <laughs> <laughs> they're going to steal a white Good Mercedes. Good luck. Um, Nails by Mermaid and said, miss you, my sweet Max. You know it. Bruce Lee with the kicks. And thank you so much for your sweet comment about my post. I appreciate your support. Love, thank you for tuning in. They are iconic. Make sure mm -hmm. you guys are following with Mermaid in. And don't forget, you guys, no matter where you are in the world, right now we have free shipping on any order over 10 US dollars to make you halas. Love it. And it's, for some reason, I'm really crazy when I buy stuff online, I do not want to pay for shipping. Like, I will, like, not order something sometimes until I get the free shipping. Usually we have free shipping on any order over 150 Oh, that's really good. And right now it's on uh, any order on for five days. That's a very good deal. And I mean, shipping is not a big deal when you think about it, but I don't know why I just get all crazy. It's very expensive. Yeah. We spend so much money on logistics every day, it's not even funny. That's crazy. And the price of, oops. Uh-oh, I wonder what happened with this one. She didn't want to stay home. Maybe I didn't put the light on long enough. Maybe. That's okay. Nothing we can't fix. So if this happens to you guys, I will show you how to fix it. I think I messed up on my light job. Don't fire me. That's okay. It was her first time. My first so time. let us 
reapply. So what we're going to do is we're actually going to etch the nail again. Like so, just like that. And then we're going to take the same sanding band and we're going to etch the inside. Oh, the other show we've been watching is Mayor of Kingstown. It's also on Paramount, but it is like intense. I don't know if anybody's seen it. Like I even told Claudia it might be too intense for her. It's pretty good. We're into it, but it's like really, it's a lot. What is it about? It's about like prisons and like a lot of drama and this guy that like, they call him the mayor, but he's not really the mayor. And he tries to keep the peace between like the town, the prisoners, the gangsters. The like bar. Orange is the New Black or what? Kind of, but yeah, like in that realm of funny. Like violence, yeah, but it's not really that funny, like, I don't know. And it's not as um, girl on girl porny. Oh, <laughs> never mind then. But it's like intense for people that like to like relax and then watch TV and go to bed, I don't know if it's for you. Where is my jar of gel? I just had it. I just saw you with it. I know, literally, we just used it. Where'd you go? Oh, here it is. Do you like um, violent shows, Max? Well, I watched The Real Housewives. Those are pretty, <laughs> pretty aggressive. Hardcore, um, fights. Glass throwing at each other of champagne. Where is my little lights? This oh, no. little light of mine. I'm fired again because I lost it. It is. This little light of mine. I'm gonna hold it. I don't trust me anymore. Max doesn't trust me anymore with the light. Just to be on the safe side. I got side. it So is CPR for the dog the same as a human? Yes, but just so much more delicate though too. Okay, like a baby CPR. Mm -hmm. What if it's a big old dog, like my dog, then you don't have to be that delicate? Uh -huh. I'm not sure. How do you even breathe you in their mouth? Their mouth is so big. You have to hold it open, so you might need two people. Okay. And then you have to be really careful though too. She might bite your face. Or like you might press down too hard and you can break the little ribs or something. Oh yeah. Aww. Oh my gosh, it looks so pretty. So pretty. Erica Starling 34 said, do you watch the, um, something Housewives of Atlanta, Real Housewives of Atlanta? Yes, but that's not on TV right now. Where is that? It's uh, off season. Go ahead and bake oh. up here. Make sure the hand's in all the way. This, uh, the season hasn't filmed yet. It ended a while ago though. I think the Jersey Shore about when they came to Tucson is going to be coming out. So oh yeah, she told me about that. <laughs> but Real Housewives of uh, New Jersey is about to start. Or I think it started yesterday, so it should be on Peacock today. And then in June, Real Hustles of Dubai starts. Oh, I would want to see that one. Homes in Dubai are really cheap right now, too. Are they? Mm-hmm. You, you could move to Dubai. I wouldn't want to live there, though. It's really hot. Oh, yeah, not good. What do you think about Martell? That's from Erica Starling. Who's Martell? I don't know. Probably one of the housewives. has to be. Maybe because she was asking about Atlanta. Maybe one of the Atlanta housewives. Maybe. It doesn't sound familiar, though. Mm -hmm. I don't know because I don't really watch them that much. It's so good, though. But they're, like, getting rid of a lot of the housewives, and they're replacing a lot of them because the ratings have been down for a little while. I'm really curious to see what's going to happen with um, Beverly Hills because it starts filming already, like, this month. Should I turn it upside down or no? Mm -hmm. It should be okay. Sherry's Boothang. Hi. Oh, he's a dude. He's not a girl. Sherry's Boothang. Sherry's? Sherry. Sherry's Boothang. Sherry, I'm sorry. Sherry. How does it feel? Um, it feels better. Last time I felt it kind of weird. Oh, and now it's good? Uh-huh. Okay. Um, Boo Creamy now said, hey, Max and Pink Army. Hi, lovely. Thanks for joining us today. I think I follow her on Instagram, too. Let's go in and blend, blend, Erica blend. Erica Starling said yes. Cherie, I guess she I don't know anything about him. Why? What's going on with uh, Sheree and her, her man? What's up with her boo thing? Do the other ones feel good or no? Mm-hmm. Yeah, like normal? Yeah. Ozzy Mate 38 said beautiful nails. Oh, thank you, my love. And we're just getting started, Barbie. We are not even done yet. 
And we're going to be using some of the new Diamond Holics. Have you guys had a chance to order the new Diamond Holics? Let us know in the comments below. It's not easy to use, but they are so gorgeous. And easy to use. There's only nine now of the Diamond Holics. So now we're going to buff the top surface of the nail. Oh, Erica said he came from Love and Marriage Huntsville. I've never seen that. I haven't either. Is it good? Who was he love and marriage to in Huntsville? I don't watch um, like love and love and hip hop. I haven't seen that, but I know it's really popular. Bye bye. I Me used to watch that. Isn't Sukiana? Wasn't she on that show? And Mama D? I think so. I bye don't bye. remember everybody. Because I used to watch it a long time ago. Erica Starling 34 said that's the show for you. What, the love and marriage? Max would like that one? I know um, a lot of people like Below Deck. That's really popular now, too. Heard of it. What is that about? It is about a crew that works on a yacht. Oh, okay. I had to think about it for a little bit. Erica Starling said it's a drama. It's drama. And I know that Little Woman Atlanta, that was really popular for a little while, too. I used to love the um, reality shows and then it kind of like I got into this like peaceful mode where I didn't want to hear all that drama like I I don't know I'm in a weird besides watching people kill each other in prisons I'm not into the drama and honestly sometimes it gets like uh, all the shows kind of just become the same they get a little repetitive yeah I think that's why I got with it and where I just didn't want to hear people bickering I don't that mind you watching you shank your prison mate but I don't want to hear women or men arguing I guess. that's why you have to be careful like I can't binge watch a show because then if there's like another season or something like that you just kind of like tune out of it yeah. Yeah. You get overwhelmed with the same stuff over and over. Yes. We're gonna buff the inside. Blue creamy now said I got the new Coquette bling on the way and the new magic syrup. Oh, are you excited? You oh my god, I love the names too. Magic syrup. Sounds like you're a little Wayne over there. Sip with the scissor. Sism. Oh, and the pressed neon pigment. So excited to get them. Ooh, for eyeshadow or for nails or for both? I know, I can't wait to see what Blue Creamy Nails does with all these things. All those phalange fantasias. Mm -hmm. Oh, and you guys, don't forget that we also have color scoops back in stock. What are color scoops? So, it's a like a mystery box of gel colors. Oh, they're cool. Mm -hmm. And it's, I think, $100 for 25 colors. Oh, wow. To make you holla. Erica Starling said, the bad thing is they make Huntsville look really bad. I hate it because I grew up in that town. Where is Huntsville? It's in jo uh, Georgia? or Alabama. Where Alabama? Where is it? Sorry for my non-knowledge of Huntsville. geography. Oh, remember the other day we were talking about how to get to that place that you have to go to? Mm-hmm. Have you figured it out yet or not? Or um, are you guys still debating on whether to go or not? No, we're going to go for sure. But my, I'm just waiting for my sister because she just got back from the whole graduation weekend. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's in Alabama. We were both off. Or did you say Alabama? I think I did say Alabama. I think I'm Max sure. is smart. Smarty farty, he's been studying the US map. I've been, I was ready, I was waiting for that question for my whole life. <laughs> it was an interview and he prepared. So right now we're taking the spring nipper and we're just trimming the dry non-living tissue. I also like the name of this tool, the spring nipper. The spring, cause it has a built-in spring. I like it. I like it. So how did your, oh, she lives in Denver though, huh? Yeah, so she went to Gunnison, Colorado for the whole graduation weekend. And that was like, you know, occupying her time. So now we got to figure out, and we need Claudia to answer. Claudia, you should be watching us because we're talking a lot of crap about you, how you look funny in the morning and how you don't answer people. And her dad, um, and dancing her daddy, the video. And her like Asian parents, Howard. Um, Anyway, Claudia has to tell us if she's going to go or not because that would make the difference between if we get like a two or three bedroom Airbnb. Like, you don't want to stay in a hotel? I don't know. I think my sister wants to stay in an Airbnb. I don't Ugh, know why. Why, why? you don't like Airbnbs? No, that's so like five years ago. Stay in a hotel so that way you can leave your towel on the floor and someone will and pick someone it up for you. And someone can cook for me for room service? Yes, Boot free breakfast. Creamy Nails is laughing. I don't know why. I oh, do. somebody named Hooters28 joined. Hello, Hooters28. Hello, Hooters. I like your name. So we're going in now with our non-acid primer. We're going around the cuticle area to chemically seal it to make sure these phalanges don't go anywhere. Erica Starling, 34, said they have NASA, the military, Boeing, all kinds of smart, smart people there. Oh, so you need to go find, like, your NASA daddy. <laughs> your sugar daddy. Look at uh, Huntsville. It's Huntsville, right? Mm-hmm. Huntsville, Alabama. Yeah, that sounds right. And they make it look like a hood rat town. Oh, oh they make it look like Bojangles. <laughs> they make it look like Tucson. We're going to go in now with Queen Hardell Top Coat to seal everything.
My yoga client used to work at Boeing for a lot of years in the D.C. area. Really? Yeah, he, he was like an engineer. I think the Boeing headquarters are in Illinois, I want to say. I know they used to have a Boeing when I lived in Kansas. I do remember that. They had not the headquarters, but I think they had like a manufacturing site or something. Yes, there. And I was really young, so I don't know exactly why I remember that. But I think because it was just like a really large building. Look how pretty that is. Look at that. Glenda the Good Witch is here to make all your dreams come true. Or what does she do? How does she even help Dorothy? She doesn't really. She's like, you had the power all along. Oh, I am here to inform you that you all that have you wasted the power all this time. Inside. No, I'm just here to like motivate people. Thank you, got this. I'm a pusher. I'm a pusher, and then people pay me to tell them they Not got it. Not a plug, it. but a pusher. <laughs> I'm good at that. I like to hype women up. I mean, men too, but men sometimes don't seem to need a lot of hyping up. They think they're the... Anyway. They got it already. Mm-hmm. Like R&R. Mm-hmm. How... Oh, I love him. I'm the meanie one. I was so mad yesterday. He's the mean one. He doesn't love his sister. He does. From far away. <laughs> I was just angry yesterday because I was hangry. And I hung up on him. On who? On Fro. Oh. But you <laughs> still saw him, though. Yeah, I still saw him. And we ate dinner together and then I was in a happy mood. Why Make the hell is sure everybody... you show the hot dog before you end the live. I'm curious. We so well nails by fur. Why the hell is everybody texting me right now? Because they know you're making me into Glenda the Good Witch. I'm like, I look over my phone and it's like, do you remember me? Why it's the random text message? Whoa, somebody said, do you remember me? Yes. Hey, hey. I don't no. know. Uh -huh. <laughs> I don't remember anybody. I know somebody was texting me this morning. And they're like, are you going to be home today? And I'm like, who is this? Because like I was telling you, I don't even like company. And I don't know the number. It's some weird area code. And then... You're like, I know I'm not going to be home. Yeah, I'm like, I don't know who you are. No, I'm not. Um, they want your attention, Max. LOL. Erica Starling said, yep. They want your attention. Royal Hand no, said, do. when will Taffy Gel be back in stock? Very soon. Very, Coming very soon. soon. All in good time, my lovely. Do you believe in, like, witches and stuff, Max? I don't believe, but I don't disbelieve. Because my friend had an encounter, and he believes that he was, like, baited by a female that was actually, like, a witch. Really? Who? It made me think of that because he said, want your attention. Um, just some girl he met at Mr. Heads. Mr. Heads? What's that? I've never been there either, okay. It's like a little club dive bar kind of thing. I think it's down by the U of A, like 4th Avenue area. Uh-huh. I've never been there. Sounds sketchy. Mm-hmm. Flawlessly Unique 828 said, I love all your products, Max. Just amazing. Oh, thank you, my lovely. We, well, Mermaiden's the real deal, so maybe we should ask her. Is she still here or did she leave already? Who? Mermaiden. Oh, Mermaiden. About what? About witches and the oh, occult. Oh, yeah. What do you think? Like... Because my friend felt convinced that she was trying to take from him. Like, her goal, he thought, was to take, like, his energy, his money, his time. Like, all of that, if that makes sense. Well, isn't that what women want from men? Yeah, I'm all, that's not a witch, honey. That's just us. A smart girl. <laughs> um, They don't want my attention, LOL. Erica said, why wouldn't they? What glitter did you use today from Cindy Chris? We used tiger and pig. Tiger is the pink one and... Glitter, it, the white one is oink oink pig. Yes. Alicia Gomez 25 said Team Teresa or Team Melissa? That's from one of the housewives I know. Teresa that. all day, every day. Yeah, I'm from the housewives of what? New Jersey. Yes, I knew it. Okay. I loathe Melissa with a passion. Why? Ugh. Tell me why. She's so annoying and she, uh, she loves to play the victim. And Melissa joined the show after well Teresa was on the first season and Melissa joined and like everything Melissa does is to like make Teresa look bad and like play herself as, as uh. out as a victim so Melissa only joined the show to spite Teresa and put all her family on blast not cool boo creamy now said out flawlessly unique 828 agreed Erica Starling uh 34 said yes that makes sense so I loathe M Melissa with a passion. Oh, I can't stand her. I hope she gets fired. Erica Starling said, I have Miss HP in. I am too much of a burden. I just do nails with Max's amazing, amazing products. What? I don't know if I missed her that. Was oh, no, title. you were at 40 oh. some. You still needed a little bit longer. I have MS HP in. 
Muscular dystrophy. Oh, okay. So it wasn't a typo. Sorry. Mm -hmm. Very nice that you can do nails with Max's products. Okay, MS multiple sclerosis, hon. Thank you. I didn't, I just didn't get how that was all strung together, but now I do, and I am so sorry to hear that. Oh, I need my pink Fantasia diamonds, too. Okay, huh? I'm really excited Number four. to see how these look. For the fantasy. Erica Starling 44 said, you're good. Thank you. We're gonna put them in our heart-shaped sorting tray. They beautiful. They look like candies in there. Aren't they beauts? They are beautiful. Okay, I think it's been a minute now. Mm -hmm. Look at that, just like that, they look so pretty, don't they? They're so beautiful. Oh, that cuticle is blended for filth. Look at that, you guys. Erica Starling 34 said, I have been diagnosed for almost 12 years. Well, that's a long time. Are you still very mobile? Pretty. My hands are pretty again. You're a real woman now. I'm a real boy. So we're gonna take our. Oh, look at that. So cool. <laughs> look how cool they look. Actually, I should freeze this so that way I can keep putting all the other ones on there. This is everybody's favorite part. The diamonds. Because, you know, a kiss on the hand can be quite continental, but... Diamonds are a girl's best friend. These rocks don't lose their shape. Diamonds are a girl's best friend. They're Lizzie Liz's best amiga. Erica Starling 34 said, I'm losing mobility in my legs. I just got told I can't work anymore. I am so sorry to hear that. We will keep you in our prayers, my love. Rexica209 said, so can I get a view of underneath the nail? I'm new to the 123 go system. Not sure what it's supposed to look like. You want to flip me over? The power of prayer is the most powerful thing ever. Uh, when we're done. Not in the middle of me blinging out the nail, my love. My bling, yeah. My... yeah. Come on. Oh, we don't want that. I was thinking, I was like, I can't do that now. Kendra actually invited me to go to the Centurion with her and her boyfriend, me and Fro. Oh, and? Um, well, obviously we didn't go because it was past 8 p.m. Because um, it was Saturday night and then Ruben had worked all day and then had to get up at 6.30 to go back and finish the job. So. But Ruben doesn't he like really no. going anywhere. No, I mean, he probably wouldn't want to go anyway, but I could try to convince him, but not. I'm not that selfish. I wouldn't try to convince him. If he was working. If he wasn't working that weekend, I'd be like, whatever. Maybe I won't convince you. Erica Starling 34 said it's fine. I'm a realist. I say it is what it is. I mean, I guess that's a good attitude to have because mm -hmm. we definitely cannot control anything yeah, other than our own behaviors and actions. So, good attitude to have. Boo Creamy Nail said the roses are so pretty. I know I'm like really very excited about them. It's different, I think, than anything I've had before. Yes, because the... Well, no, we've done some girly nails on you before. Mm -hmm. But they were more like bows and stuff. These are like roses, like... Uh, and then it's Mother's Day is right around the corner. Oh, it is. I always forget that because I'm not... My child is not going to be here, so I'm You're not like, really oh, I forget her mom sometimes. Right? Because she's not watching my live, so how can I even be a mom? Yeah, Claudia. <laughs> But Max lets me still be creative. Yes, and I love that. And it's like, I see that all the time. Like, even at the gym, people that are, you know, recovering, obviously, from something. Like, using walkers, all the stuff, they're still there. Or, like, people that have hobbies. It's just keeping yourself busy and being positive, creative. All that will make your life fulfilled. Mm -hmm. Erica Starling said they look very delicate. Yes, I like that word. They do look very delicate. I'm gonna put a square one in here. Blue creamy nail says I got 
I got the light pink ones too. Ooh, nice. Can't see. We'll wait to see what you do with them. And you guys know that the new Diamond Holics make it so much faster and easier to create the fantasy because everything is already there for you. So you don't have to have like 20,000 different trays because everything is already ready to go. So cool. <gasps> Look how pretty that is. That is gorgeous. Let's freeze it. I love it. It's very lizzy. See, he took the wand. I'm not allowed to have that wand anymore. I'll give Never you. Never again. The other hand right now, you can practice with it a little bit. Okay. And then watch tomorrow. She's gonna be like Max. The worst thing happened. I'm like, no! Oh, it won't fall off. Oh my gosh, don't jinx myself. I'm just kidding. No, I kind of don't even want to do it now because I'm like, I'm going to screw it up. These Chinese EDMs are really weird. Mm hmm. Do you like it? Mm hmm. That's Feels a like no. You should skip. Feels like you should skip to skip it. Skip to Maluma, darling. Yeah. <laughs> with the Chinese EDM. <laughs> But it's nice that uh, my videos don't get taken down. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Because we could play some horrible stuff and then they'll take it down. Play some sexy red. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, I think that's enough for one finger. Okay. What do you guys think? I think it's beautiful. You did good with the lamp. Don't be discouraged. Oh, thank you. It was the I first guess, time. Yeah, it was my first time. I'm not really good with things that take patience and delicacy. But if you need some blocks moved, I'm your girl. <laughs> She's like, call me. You should have seen us yesterday trying to figure out how to use the Cricut. We're literally going to have a girl teach us. Oh yeah, do any of you people on here know how to use the Cricut? What's a Cricut? It's like, um, so you can make your own like stickers, t-shirts, clothes. You can make your own apron. Like... It's really cool if you know how to use it, but I don't. And my attention span is like that of a fly. I was laying on the floor with my legs up in the air, and then I kind of realized I wasn't focused. Yeah, like this isn't really for me. This isn't working, Star. But yeah, so we're going to have this lady. We're going to do trade with her, and she's going to teach us how to use it. Because we want to make a big sign for the bridal expo. I want to start printing my own clothes. I can make RR masonry stuff. I'll make something for you oh. if you want. Um, once I learn how to use it, I'll also be Properly. patient. Yeah, I'm gonna be patient. You're oh, patient. Erica Sterling said, yes, I know how, but I don't have one. Oh my gosh, I wish you lived here, Erica, because I have one and I don't know how to use it, so we're exactly the opposite. Was it expensive? Um, yeah, it was like $500, and then we had to buy the heat press, so me and Star are like splitting it. And I think it'll be worth it once we know how to use it, but as of right now, we don't know how to do it. Um, Silent ONG said, I use the Cricut. I just learned from YouTube videos. I know. Oh my gosh. Well, I very admire you, but I am like unable to do that. I watch a YouTube video. I'm telling you, even TikTok, Max is the only thing I can watch. The only thing. Anything and else, I you watch, could watch it for uh, two Mary Magdalene videos. Yeah, but even that, I had a kind of a You're like, low I'm, attention I'm, span. Plus, I'm sitting you here. You were in and out of it. <laughs> yeah. Plus, I'm sitting here and I can't move because Max is holding onto my hand very tightly. Um... Yeah, I'm just horrible. I feel like I would learn better. It's called a kinesthetic learner. I feel like I need someone live in person to sit down and show me. Then I'll pay attention I can do it. Because you won't have a choice. Yeah. But if I'm watching stuff, like, I don't know. My mind just wanders when I watch YouTube. Um, Erica Starling 34 said, I wish I lived there too. I would volunteer to be Max's model all the time. Yes, you could be Max's model. You could help me learn how to do my cricket. Oh my gosh, we just had some drama about one of the models, too. Oh no, tell us the tea. No, you were you were telling me what I should do. Oh yeah, mm -hmm. I'm great at giving advice to other people. Mm -hmm. If anybody needs advice, I got you. If I need to do it only with my Even own Even though it was kind of sad. What is, but like, because I'm in but I think the, so I'm I think just she very should... direct. Like, I just like to tell people. She needs something that can accommodate her better, I think. Mm -hmm. Especially given the, the circumstance that she's in right now. And people think that means that you're like mean or you don't care, but it's not quick. And I think the reason I'm like that is I would rather because you can see the other me, side. Yes, and like I would rather someone tell me that I'm sitting here and I don't know why. Like not knowing why something's happening bothers the heck out of me. Mm -hmm. If I know the why of it, I'm like okay. Like she said, 
it is what it is, then that's fine. But when I don't know why, that's it drives what. me crazy. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. So I'm direct with people because I appreciate people being direct with me. And some people don't love when an Aries is direct with them. You're like, be, don't, don't. They're sensitive, sorry. Don't shoot the bullet. And I'm super nice. Like, I'm, I don't ever want to hurt anyone's feelings or be harsh. But I'm just like, I'd rather just say what it is. Sometimes you have to. Mm-hmm. And then that's up to them whether they accept it or not. Like, if you're a straight shooter and you're honest, then if they oh, want to get mad so or not pretty. understand that, that's on That's their problem. Mm -hmm. That's so pretty, Max. The stones are beautiful. They are on Days and Chris. People don't like me because I am the same way. Yes, and it's like... I, I know, but... <laughs> But I think it's a good quality. I do. I appreciate it very much in people. Or like if someone's acting weird with me, I'd rather them just like, I don't like you and I don't want to like whatever. It is what it is. Work huh? with you or whatever. But I'm like, then if they just act weird. It is what it is. Like, it really is. Yep. We're not for everybody. But we are for those that are. For us. <laughs> that can read. Yeah. Yep, yep. When I was kind of going through the same thing because I had um, I had a girl that I was doing trade with and she was helping me with my social media needs, and it was fine. But like, after we finish this negotiated term, I don't think I'm gonna continue with her anymore. Mm -mm. Alicia Gomez twenty five said, "Love those roses," but I'm also gonna say the truth. I love these roses too. Exactly. It is what it is. That's our motto of the day. It is what it is. Alicia Gomez 25 said better real than fake. Yeah, and I think I'm just going to tell her very nicely that it's not working out. Because it's not like you just like someone or you're mad or any of those things. It's just like this. It's not working it's out. It's not working out. And that's the name of the game. Mm -hmm. It is what it is, said Lizzie Liz. Yep. And I will let you know what it is. <laughs> Without sugarcoating it. Mm -hmm. As it should be. Mm -hmm. But I'm like, that also means you know I'm not playing games. Or if I say something nice, I mean that with all my heart because I said it. Because it comes from the, the gut. You? I have a cup that says it is what it is. I need that cup. You need a shirt on the front that says it is what it is. And on the back, I have nothing to wear. <laughs> <laughs> I'm my own sugar daddy. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm gonna have one that says still looking for multiple sugar daddy. <laughs> Any volunteers? Any volunteers. So a girl at the salon told me today she has a sugar daddy that she um she's not intimate or anything with him, but he likes to be um like roughed up a little bit. But she's like fully clothed and that's all. I'm like wow. But what is she wearing? Like that? leather or something? No, I think just like normal clothes. Sure. That's what she said. Why would she even tell me about the whole sugar daddy thing and then lie about the details, huh? I mean, I was all excited about it, whatever it was going like. on. You're like, tell like, me more. for you, girl. Yeah. I had that cup custom made. Ooh, smart. Smart. See, if I knew how to use my Cricut, I could make us all custom cups. We have here. the new tumblers. Have you seen those? The new innovator.com tumblers? No. What did you... Oh, I think I See, gave I you a little See, I could print one for you when hmm. I learned how. It'll be my gift to everyone. It'll be like stuff I print on my oh, Look how pretty that is. Look at that, you guys. I feel like I'm magical. She's a real princess now. Mm-hmm. Perfect. So pretty. Let's freeze that for a few seconds. Ooh, so then I'm also listening to a podcast about Floyd Mayweather Jr. And it's like... It goes into his whole life and the crimes he committed. There's a lot of domestic violence. Like, because I'm the type also when I hear things about celebrities, I don't necessarily believe it just because they hear it. Because you don't know if, like, the press is just exaggerating or making them look Out of bad. proportion. But hearing this podcast and, like, they're citing it with, like, actual police reports and stuff, I'm like, there was a lot of domestic violence going on. Like, that. With Floyd May Mayweather? That he was accused and convicted of. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Against his wife or who? Uh, I guess it was his first baby mama. I'm still in the middle of the podcast, but it was 
his first baby mama where he like punched her in the throat at a mall and like this stuff was documented i'm not saying it's true because i apparently obviously was not there but you're like i cannot confirm nor I cannot deny. confirm nor deny i was not there i was a teen mom at the time doing my own thing um because he's like the same age as me really mm -hmm. so yeah but there was just a lot like there's a lot more because i feel like i only heard like one or two things on the news and again you don't know if it's like true or just people just want money or like you don't know what's going on there was a lot erica starling 34 said when i finally got my taxes i am going to buy a tumbler from max nice hopefully you get them soon mm -hmm. and our tumblers right now are less than ten dollars a tumbler and if you buy two of them it's free shipping yeah, that's right, right? <laughs> yes because it won't qualify because it has to be ten dollars uh -huh. let's bake that for a minute Are you ready for your hot dog, Lizzie Liz? I'm so ready. Should we show them? Yeah, because we're okay, almost done pretty you much. You open it and show them the hot dog, and then, then I can eat it. I held off for like a good hour for you. So yeah, you she's like over here, like, like having a panic uh, attack, about hypoglycemic. I wonder where you got them from. Probably down the street, wherever it's closest. He didn't get any avocado or anything like that. He's fired. You guys ready? So this is what they come packaged it in. So exciting, guys. Ooh, and you got a little jalapeno wrapped in bacon. And then here you have the bread. As you can see, it's quite fluffy. And then it has mustard, mayonnaise, salsa, tomato, no onions, and the bacon wrap frank. You can order onions, but I would get mine without onions. But if you need it to order in Spanish, it's sin cebolla. Sin cebolla. Por favor. Señor. Oh my God, these are so good. You, one's for you, Max. Is it really? No, you eat both. I'm on a diet, Liz. I'm on a diet too. No, you're not. <laughs> you I know, need I'm to a liar. You need to accept yourself the way the Lord made you. What about you, Max? Mm. I'm just kidding. I'm not really on a diet. <laughs> I mean, maybe I should be, but I'm not. <laughs> We're going to seal the edges now with liquid gummy. Make sure they don't I get love tangled. all the names. Why does all your stuff just sound like either naughty or nasty? Because all men are pigs. Because you named it like that? I had to give them names that uh, were easy to remember too. Mm-hmm. Oops. She is getting hangry. I just actually drank a big... Jamba juice. Jamba juice smoothie on the way here. And I brought Maxi one. But I don't even think he's drinking it. Yeah, I am. But I know Lizzie Liz, uh, she has her diabetes. So she's mm -hmm. got to eat and I don't want her blood sugar to get low. Because we still got one hand to go. Mm-hmm. And these nails take a little bit of time just because there's so much uh, detail involved. Because they're so beautiful. And I want to make sure that these diamonds don't go anywhere. Mm -mm. But also, once Kendra puts in my French braids, then they won't even get caught in my hair because I literally won't. You're going to have braids for the fantasy. Mm -hmm. So go around the edges, make sure we seal everything so that we don't go anywhere. Whoa, look at these nails. That's nails and hair, girl. Hello. Do you love them? Erica said they are beautiful, Max. I'm living for this coquette moment. He always does beautiful work. Always, always, always. Because coquette is the way of the future now. Mm -hmm. It's like the trend for this year. It's like the ultimate, like, super girly feminine style. Who doesn't want to be a coquette? Like, lots of blush, ribbons in your hair. Exactly. Nails and Hair Girl said yes, love them so much. And Cindy Chris said, Lizzie won the nails of the week. I got the best nails, Max. And we're just getting started, Barbie. Oh, wait, it's only Monday. We're I don't feel do, as special. <laughs> we're going to do a little bit of liquid gummy on the inside to seal the edge, too. So I want to keep best nails of the week, even though it's only Monday. So, I mean, so nobody's make... nails can be better than mine. Are you sure? That won't be fair then. Mm -hmm. The other girls are going to get jealous. Let them. Okay, let's bake that for one minute. I'm almost done with my Jamba Juice, see? Oh, okay. It has gone down. Fine. It's can like I right get here a now. close-up? Rexy 209. Of the hot dog or my nails just came? <laughs> no, you can't. <laughs> Erica Starling said he always gives me ideas. I am trying a new shape next time. Ooh, that's exciting. I know he's like so creative. I don't even know how he thinks of the things he thinks of. I don't know either. That's why I watch all my shows. Are you good at interior designing? Never tried it. So who designed your, like in your house? Or is it just stuff from your mom? My mom. 
I mean, you designed this, but it's like a warehouse, not a house, so you can't, like, there's only so much you can do with it. People walk in and they think it's a toy store. No, it, I mean, it's super cool, but I mean, it's not really, like... But they think it's a toy store because of all the massive uh, Pokemon um, uh, Pokemon yes. cards I have. It's quite uh, excessive. I want Anna to decorate our house. And then I have... Did you see my big old Power Ranger toy that I, that I had to ship over from Japan? That's super cool. I like the... above it. Size. The... I like the sword. Yeah, the sword is life size. I had to ship it because oh, it's that's a Power Ranger. Yeah, Japanese okay, okay, Power okay. Ranger. King oh, yeah, Oja. I love it. So it makes noise and lights up. I don't know. I didn't open the box. I want to take it out and sword fight you. Do you have two swords? I do actually. Oh my god, do you want to sword fight me? I man? bought one of this. Do you one, guys want to see a sword fight? But I bought it uh, already oh, out of the box. Max is gonna be like, my nose. <laughs> I'm not gonna open it. It's a collector's I'm, item. Okay, well let's buy some cheap ones at Walmart. And, sword and then this fight. one is a Kita Major. <laughs> this one is King Oja. Very cool. And then I have another one for this current season of Power Rangers. Boom Boom Onger. Boom Boom. I like them. I used to call Claudia, um, Claudia Boom Boom. Claudia Boom Boom. Claudia Boom Boom. And now she makes it go Boom Boom. Boom Boom in the Boom Boom room. Oh, you can flip it upside down for me. I feel like these nails took a long time, but then they didn't take a long time either. Mm -mm. A little bit of both. But that's because they got so much detail in them too. And then we're gonna get our cotton candy cuticle oil ready too for the fantasy. Oh, Cindy Chris said it arrived really fast. About 10 days or so, which isn't too bad. Not too bad at all. So I actually ordered these jeans because Claudia made me a style Pinterest board and told me I better order some of this stuff because she spent a lot of time doing it. What what jeans? Oh, my jeans I'm wearing. Cause oh. I'm wearing real pants, guys, not workout pants. What's so like different or special about them? I don't know, just that. They're like more modern. I feel like I still had all the like, um, my jeans are more old school where it was like tight all the way down the leg, just tight jeans, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. And these are more like cargo jeans. But still with the fitted booty. So she just, well, there she gave me a bunch of stuff on there, but these were from Sheen, so they were cheap. Some of the things she put on there were too expensive. No, <laughs> so I'm gonna get the knockoff version. That's her option, love. I know. Beautiful. But she said she spent so much time I had to order things. So I'm trying. Because she made the board. Mm-hmm. On Pinterest. That should be like a job, making people style boards on Pinterest. Oh, she, but she likes doing that kind of stuff, though, mm -hmm. huh? Because she made one for her boyfriend because she said he was kind of old school and she's trying to get him to wear Hoochie Daddy shorts. Hoochie Daddy shorts? What do you Daddy think shorts? about Hoochie Daddy shorts? What's that? Oh, my God, Max. I didn't know either. <laughs> um, huh? Oh, the purple? Did my mom call? Yeah. Oh. Well, we have to bury it. Tell her to not throw it away. We're going to bury it. Vamos a enterrarla. Cindy Chris said stunning. To ask her if the, the thing arrived. Ask her if the thing arrived. Blue Cream Manuel said those are stunning. Amazing no, sí, job sí, as sí, always, Max. Thank you, my love. No, Max. It hasn't arrived yet? Jeez, that's taking forever. Um. Well, yeah, hoochie daddy shorts. What's a hoochie daddy short? They're sh like short shorts. You know how men and boys are wearing like shorter shorts now? Really? Mm -hmm. I don't think men should wear like crop tops. I know that's not a very popular opinion, but I mean, I unless you're an athlete, then I don't think you should wear a crop top. Or you're a 1980s rocker with a mullet, then you. Yeah, I don't. And you're not wearing a mesh crop top. I don't. No. I don't think they're flattering on men unless you have like a flat stomach. Well, that's where they're. Beer they're, belly guys shouldn't wear a crop top. Well, no, they're designed for like athletes, aren't they? I mean, I think they're designed for. Like women Johnny, or trans if you women. look like Johnny Depp in Nightmare Before Nightmare on Elm Street, then I mean, then you can probably pull off a crop top. But again, that was the '80s, right? Yes, and he was like 18 and like. Now before all the. Uh, said you should wear some max. She wants you to wear Gucci Daddy shorts. That's okay. I need a wax. Kara's creation said, oh no, did I hear one of the puppies pass? Yeah. She I'm did. Sad. The so small sad. one. Super sad. And I don't want to bum everybody The out. smallest one. And then the, the feeder hasn't arrived yet. <gasps> Look how beautiful they are, Lizzie Liz. Oh yes, it is. And somebody said, giving Queen Elizabeth 20th century vibes. Ooh, that's from Alicia. I agree. And actually, I love that. Like Marie Antoinette. Marie they are very Marie Antoinette. Um, I need one of those pastries. They took about an hour and a half, which isn't too bad for nails this long with glitter inside, glow in the dark acrylic, and coquettes and diamonds. That's a lot. Mm -hmm. 
And I love the balance too. I love that two fingers are super, super heavy. And then the other ones are like really like, they still have bling and everything like that, but it's just more like soft. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. It's all about creating a balance in the phalange. They said, OMG, gorgeous nails, beautiful max. I love it. 1970 short shorts, nails and hair rooms that I'm joking. I've worn some like that before, but I have really hairy legs. Where did you wear them to seventh grade PE class? <laughs> no, I've worn them before here, I think. Oh, I've never seen you in Hoochie Daddy shorts. $150 set and more. Yeah, definitely. These are like a million dollars. A million dollars set. Look at those roses, though. So pretty. Beautiful. Well, my lovelies, that's going to wrap up our little demo for today. I hope you guys enjoyed it. They came out so stunning. They are just serving us Marie Antoinette Glenda, the Good Witch Stripper Realness for Lizzie Liz. And we're going to head on over to TikTok, do the other hand, and we'll see you guys tomorrow, late afternoon, because I have a dentist appointment at 1. So after that, I will be here. I love you guys, and don't forget to take advantage of the free shipping going on all... I was going to say all week, but it's for the next five days, so till Friday. Oh, underneath, she wanted to say. Oh, that's what they look like on the inside. Just they're a little dusty right now. Beautiful. She's like, I love that we can go crazy with the bling. I think yes. when, when you went to Thailand, we did a lot of bling, lot too. Of bling. Those nose um, were heavy as heck. That's why Max loves me, because I let him do whatever he wants to me. Because that's what a model is. She's a muse. She's an inspiration. That's what a real woman is. A real woman. <laughs> love you guys, and we'll be back tomorrow. Bye, everybody. Bye.